Hello my soccer universe. As I already said in a previous video and now I know there are a lot of unpacking videos during this international break but you know there are international jerseys and I actually think I, I always want to unpack a little bit within the theme although it not always happens but you know international break there are not too many other videos being made so let's do some unpackings in there and we'll talk more about shirts and all that kind of stuff. In any case, as I already said with the Turkey unpacking, there are some teams where I want to augment also coming into the Euros and one of these teams is Scotland. I gotta be honest with you, I think of all the home nations, Scotland was always among my favorites, if not the favorite. Overall, uh, I love the home colors and you know, now I have also some friends from Scotland, which actually makes it even nicer in a way, but I also have friends in England, so you know. Uh, don't have anyone from Northern, Northern Ireland or Wales, so curiously enough, but you know, those are much smaller nations. In any, any, any case, there's also a certain parallel I always feel between Austria and Scotland as well. So there's always some sympathy for me there. Now, um, I have two Scotland home jerseys. I have this one that was gifted to me by Andy and I have the one from the 98 World Cup. Uh, both of those are relatively similar with the uh, pattern that they have on there. And I like both very, very, very much. But I always thought oh, maybe I should have an away jersey as well. And when I got the Slovenian, the Albania jersey, a well, part of me also wanted to ask Andy for, you know, maybe a Scotland away jer uh, a jersey. But then I didn't necessarily want to spend because, you know, sometimes it gets a little bit too much and uh, gotta, gotta see. But the one thing is Scotland jerseys rarely pop up on Wilhelm. Scotland away jerseys I've never seen except a fake one from the early 90s. Now I really wanted to have an away jersey, although the way the draw went, I don't think a Scotland will wear their away jersey, which is now, I think it's uh, off-white and purple number. Well, this one that I found here in Wilhelm, I found it. I think we agreed on 22 euros. Uh, seller initially will have 20, 25 or for 20. We agreed on 22 and I picked it up and I have it. This one is a yellow one. For me, that's kind of almost the classic Scotland away color and it's a very interesting one um, upon showing it to, to my wife she said that color is a little bit too bright and if you wear it you look a little bit sick well so be it I actually like it it's this one from 2018-19 I don't know how often this was worn um, but I have to say this is a very I really like this template because it has this weird checkerboard pattern that's also with lines um, it has the thistle here on the bottom which is i think a really nice touch and i really like the way that the colors co combine yes i agree this uh, the color gives me more brazil vibes than maybe scotland vibes um, and maybe the secondary yellow you know you have the main yellow which is a little bit bright but the other one gets a little bit too light but overall i think it's a pretty nice looking jersey and I'm happy to have a Scotland away jersey. So yeah, I may not need a Scotland away jersey, but I'm quite happy that I have caught Scotland. Check mark, we have home and away. Probably need that for other teams as well, but for Scotland, I'm, though I probably won't need it, as I repeatedly keep saying, I'm very happy to have it done. So Scotland set is complete. Of course, of course, I would love to have a white one too. And if I think about Scotland jerseys, I know it would have been a major expense, but if there's in any way at some point that 150th anniversary shirt popping, I would love that one. It was one of the best shirt releases last year. So yeah, uh, we have to look into that one. This was a really, really fine jer uh, jersey that I would love to have. But you know, I'm totally fine with these and the 98 one. Um, the Tartan jersey from 1996 was also also nice one, but I think overall Scotland I'm really good. But you know, it few additions might not hurt the the, the collection. I actually think I was one of the few that liked the one from 2014, the away jersey, the white with yellow and pink that didn't look that bad. If you were to ask me, I know some Scotland fans didn't like it. I didn't like the pink away jersey though. In any case, please let me know, did I do a good choice here with the yellow one? Yes, it's a white one now, but I actually, I, I always think Scotland away should, should, should be yellow, maybe not the bright yellow, but I, the, I, I really like it. I like the one, I especially like the template. So as I said already, any case, 
With thumbs up, enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts, and I will talk to you soon about more things in my soccer universe. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you may enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye.